Hi everyone, Maria here, founder of Store Balance and Harmony. i just been talking to a woman this morning and I thought I would get on here and just quickly have a chat with you all. The The number one question that I um, get asked or the, or the concern, the biggest concern that women have when, when we have a conversation is, will this work for me? I don't know if this will work. I'm not sure if I can do this, okay, that is the number one concern that women have. It is the the very first question I get asked. And <clears throat> even after, you know, women have committed and they've said, yes, I'm going to do this, and they sit down for their, for their absolute very first session, it is still a, a voice that is running around in their head. Now, I, I, I want to bring this up because I want you to know if that is what you are thinking, then we can still have a conversation and work through that. Okay, this is not just you thinking that you can't do it. Every single woman I think that has ever done Creatrix has thought this particular thing. Okay, I did. When I first heard about you know, this tool that could help set women free of their emotional baggage. I didn't know if I could do it. I wasn't sure what it was, what it meant, but I knew, and this is what, this is the most, I knew that I wanted to get rid of my emotional crap. I wanted to get rid of the, the mind noise that was running around the, I'm not good enough and the, I can't do it. And, and, you know, fear of being alone and lonely and, and the sadness and anger and all those other things that I had going on. I knew that I wanted to get rid of that and I knew a hundred percent that I would try anything to get to that end result and I would do what it took to do that and I had tried a lot of other things and I had got no results or some results and then you know it had, I'd fall back into that that those those sad ways um I I I, I took a leap of faith and even when I started, I, you know, committed and I, and I um, spent money and I traveled away when I went, when I had my first breakthrough, I traveled away to a three day retreat. I was still in that room thinking, you know what, I'm not sure if I can do this. It, it is something that is, is a pattern or a condition, um, a, a constant that most women have okay you are not alone if this is what you are thinking you are not alone in thinking that you know maybe I can't do this but let me tell you if you are at a place where you are 100% ready I am so fucking sick of this shit I am so sick and tired of feeling sick and tired I want something better if there is some part of you I know that there is something better out there I want to feel better I want to be better I want to do more if you are there and you want more out of your life there's some little voice deep inside you that's telling you that you can be more you can feel better you can do amazing things in this world if you just we don't know what it is that we just want to do or just have to do. But let me tell you, that it will never come from outside validation, okay? I've tried it, you know. There's thousands of women who have gone through, through this process and they've all tried it, you know. If I had, you know, a man or if I had a better job, if I had a nicer house, if I had more money, you know, then, then I'd feel better. This outside validation looking for our our peace or our um, joy from somewhere or someone else it doesn't work it needs to come from within and when you have that life is so much better so much easier it, it flows okay there's a joy inside you that just lights you up and if you want to get to it doesn't matter what the issues are have a conversation have a talk with me it's you know it's not going to hurt trust me it doesn't hurt but you know I, I don't want you to not reach out because you think this won't work for me or I'm afraid I can't do it okay I don't want that BS mindset to stop you from even reaching out for that conversation okay I want, and it is my passion, and I made um, a promise to myself that I was going to make big impact this year. 
that I was going to help so many women to get rid of their BS, to get rid of that feeling like we're not good enough or we're not living our life fully. And I want to help you if you are there in that place where, you know what, I'm not making the most of my life. You know what, I'm just going through the motions. I feel not myself. I feel I've lost some part of me or I feel like I'm not living up to this, this voice that's inside me telling me that I have more to do. If you're there and you want to feel better, you want more, if you want to get rid of that, you know, I don't care if it's just, you know, some some mindset blocks that are stopping you from moving forward in your business or if it's depression, sadness, anxiety, you know, big, deep emotional stuff. If that is holding you back, reach out for a conversation. Don't think that this is like everything else because it's not. It's not. It is female specific for one and it cuts the ties with past emotional pain or the blocks, the mindset, the beliefs that keep us stuck. But when we have a conversation, I commit 100% to you if you commit 100% to yourself to do this process and, and everybody women, sorry, not men, sorry, I, I don't work with men, um, you know, you can see remarkable and amazing changes if you commit to you, if you commit to changing your life, you can do this. We can do this together. Okay, so just a quick one, I just wanted to get on here really, really quickly and say that, you know, maybe this is the reason why you haven't reached out. Maybe there's a little voice saying that I can't do it, or maybe I won't be able to, or maybe it won't work for me. That is just BS that's running around in here. Okay, don't listen to it. You have to make a conscious choice to make change for a better life. And if you are ready then reach out, PM me, or I'll leave a, a, a link to my calendar underneath this. Book a free call. We can have a chat, all right? Won't cost you anything to have that conversation to see if this is right for you, okay? And the only thing that's going to determine that is if you are 100% ready to get rid of your shit. That is it. You commit to you, I will commit to you too. So I hope to hear from you soon. Bye-bye.